how to make a mega press connection inch and a quarter through two inch. First and foremost, make sure that the fittings read Vega. This ensures that you are using a mega press fitting. Next, make sure the fitting has the appropriate color dots, labels, and seals to match the system. In this case, HNBR for gas, yellow dots, yellow labels, yellow seals. Next, make sure every press end has a factory installed sealing element, stainless steel grip ring, and spacer. Cut your pipe square, ream and deburr, and prep the pipe surface. Make sure the pipe surface where the sealing element makes contact is smooth and free of any nicks or loose debris. Fully insert your pipe into the shoulder of the fitting and mark the pipe where it meets the edge. This will ensure full insertion depth. Now for the tooling. Make sure that your ring reads Megapress and is in the correct size. Insert the appropriate actuator into the tool, engage the pin, and power the tool on. Place the ring around the hub of the fitting centered in the polished gap. There will be a substantial gap between the two ends of the ring. Place the actuator into position. Make sure that there is no interference and then pull the trigger until the tool stops making noise and releases. Here's one more look with sound from another angle. And that is how you make a proper Megapress G connection. For best results, make sure you're taking Scotch-Brite to the inside of your rings to polish that surface for a nice, clean, smooth press. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact us at vega.us.